Welcome back. PSG Quest versus Talon, winner advances on. Loser has to play another best of three tomorrow. And the problem, downside of that, of course, is the supports of Quest are really good at enabling. Specifically, new, where we have a 2 2 bug oh. to trade when you're taking some heavy duty damage. Omar with the flak and uh, the rocket rod coming in. On your first blooded shackle from Yoka interrupted. And. Omar will be able to actually get away thanks to the fairy fire. I mean, I I just never read Enchant because I never expected him to actually change anything. Yokam is going to get taken down in the bottom lane. One month ago, I just recorded a video for YouTube talking about neutral items and Q1. Q1 is going to get blasted oh, the big in damage. Burn charges, Ducala's rotation. Uh, this is what you were talking about. Oh, he also TPing bottom lane, going to help out TA 2000 WS in the trees. The urn is going to take him down. Yokam is going to be the next target. And this is. He gets the support from the bottom lane supports, and then he immediately runs up towards uh, bottom to help out the core. This is some great communication with PSG Quest. And WS needs to be careful. He's level 3. He's going to die again. Blast. Oh low, my he's God. gonna get slowed down. G2000, the dive disaster. is worthwhile. And now you're gonna have a useless blood seeker this game. And I have a group of friends on Discord with the heroic players, Analog and KJ, etc. And they're like, yo, a light collector gives you bonus movement speed. W w what are you saying by. What are you saying by, by putting this item here? And everyone was like, yo, I didn't know that. So it's hard to remember. I mean, that that I definitely does like collector. Got, just got nerfed because it was too OP. It was way yeah. too OP. So much damage. Like no one can su survive. They can't respond. Oh, Chiwan. oh, oh those God. nice stacks that you're giving me, Chiwan. Very nice of you. And Yokam will be able to walk away. Omar TPing towards mid. Chiwan needs to be careful. There is a bit more coming out. Homing missile. Pitching in after the Kunka call down the body. Oh, that call down is so oh. perfect. Oh my god. We won't be able to get oh, themselves no. catch on the Shadow Shaman, but the king will be next. That was a really clutch call down. Staring to your soul. Be tuned. Oh, he waveforms oh. in! <laughs> That's the oh. classic morphing death right there. Full Aji. And think, oh, easy creeps gets absolutely smacked. Ponyo is not even level six yet, so now just gets his level six. Can use overgrowth would be a waste. But they are eight k ahead in a twelve-minute game. <sighs> I don't want to be this guy, but and you are gonna. I be. think I'm going to be. Uh, I don't want to be, but I'm going to be. They need to to play the game, pick him on the next one. Manta rolling Thunder comes out. Yokan taken down. The blink dagger on Malik as well, being able to get used. They find two quick kills. <laughs> Had to do the most sexy play alive. Oh, TA2000 in trouble. There's a lot of enemies around him. This time they might actually be able to get a kill. The rupture on a person that is completely standing still. Okay, WS does manage to get the kill at the very least. And. One BKB TP out the rest of the team in a bit of trouble. Hoping this is going to connect on towards the Palace as a response, but they are in a world of hurt, I would think. However, they do manage to get out with only one loss, one death. They saw the smoke coming, but they didn't want to TP to help because oh. they were smoking to help Luna. Oh, they just killed David. Okay, guys. that's hilarious. He took the gateway to immediately die. <laughs> I read. Definitely remember Tofu as well. Buying it. I guess there are multiple people that go for that route. There's going to be the rush to go now. Malik is in trouble and they find a kill with TA2000 now on the run. BKB is about to end, but he's going to get dragged back. Still has his own BKB available. Can they pop that Aegis for once? Nope. Oh my TA2000 God. <laughs> stay alive through it all. Obviously, BKB does significantly help. When is going to get spotted out by Malik, there's the dust. Three in trouble! Oh! 
Oh, he actually gets knocked back into the dust. <laughs> That's a little bit unfortunate. She won. Noob summons TA2000 to immediately go for the Chiwan kill. And the second one down. He does have satanic. Yeah, satanic. Finish. Yeah. X. Let me get the control. Hold the force. Oh, no, oh, 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 and they get the gas coming through, it is going to be, oh my god, Rolling Thunder flies in towards the fight. Viper comes out, BK, 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 out of there. They're trying to disengage, Ponyo is still alive, he's got the charge, so he'll be able to creep on through. Viper force out on the gyrocopter. The beautiful golden blaze. Gets annihilated. Oh, bro, comes out into the kill. They find you who doesn't have a buyback to be so Omar will actually be a dieback if he gets taken down. The folks and everyone else, but the case himself because he's got the agents anyway. And there is WS coming in with the BKB charging, bashing on the Malik. The root comes out for Ponyo and Malik. Triangle here is he gonna get taken down? WS, he's so close. No, Malik saves. Oh, alive. he's alive. And it will be a DX. TV. Actually, TA2000 gets dragged back. He just Lucky bought a dagger? He bought a bling so he could disengage on the moon. Oh. <laughs> okay, that's pretty. But that's a pretty nice play. Move. Oh, they think can kill off. That smart comes out, but they find the size of the one. Oh, Bond has a fly back. Have the rupture at the ready as well. Rolling Thunder has been used here, 2000. Oh, Blade, bro. Yeah, no buyback. He on got jumped again. No Actually, only WS has the buy buyback. Oh, the fuck! Ooh! Uh, like B2, he doesn't have the money. And he needs to straight up dead. That's it. There's not, not anything that they can realistically do at this stage. He was farming with. With X in case you got a game, but it's or not. Oh, G1, it comes to the Eclipse. When you're in the fountain, G2000 is diving. GG gets called, and it's PSG Quest taking game number one with their very aggressive early game track. That, you know, finishes the game in 39 minutes. Spear's the best thing to. to. to to steal this game. If, if he got speared, they got a lot of engage and just disengage. He dude is just right clicking away in the bottom lane with the essence shifts. Yeah, I think Slark is it's having a, a nice time on bottom, especially because the top is the, the on top. He okay. rotates it through. Actually, you need to be careful not to die because there's a rotation coming through. They find you. And Yokem will die in response, but good early rotations from Talon right there. Ponyo needs his far away from home. Dallas is gonna push him back. Ponyo might just uh, feed away his life for nothing but loop. Oh, the rolling thunder comes up immediately. Cancelled by G1. Gets the kill. That's it. He just respawn loop. Looking for an extended fight, it seems. But they're gonna back off. I'm curious if he's gonna go for a mage start this game or just defuse a blade axe. On those lines, we're gonna, gonna become fake on towards the battle as it goes. Noob is also in the top lane. A lot of damage with the blast, but there's Chi one looking for Noob, knowing the counter is a pretty big kill. WS needs to be careful. Omar's gonna get taken down. Man of gets used, but WS still has a free. The freeze on to TA2000. He is dead. Noob looking for the WS kill. Can he get it? Yes, he can, oh. but he is being ran down. With the swash bump coming in, do might kill Ponyo. Nope, the crystal maiden should be able to get himself out of there. You can see that both both of Tails were the same that we always talk about quest. Oh, of course. Omar is gonna get pushed over the cliff, and she won. The swashbuckles doesn't want to lose that kill. Okay, so he's going mana boots on the Pango. 
instead of uh, power checks. So G1 in trouble though. He used the swashbuckle preemptively. Six kills she picked up by Kukau. He's immediately looking for Yokam who stole the spear. That's a dangerous spell to steal, and that's going to cost Noob his life. Kukau is trying to go for Yokam. B2 is here. That's going to be stats to steal. And indeed, there we have it. The first perma Aji stolen of the game. So they can't enable both supports to help Koro because Koro just died too fast. Oh, Yokam. You get a good spell steal. Steals illuminates. Of course, two guys immediately afterwards. Is going to be a misses the spear. Oh, the damage. One, you're rolling thunder comes through by G1. And they will find themselves being killed in the process. They lose Yokam, but they get everything that they desire from that engagement. The Gallus didn't have, doesn't have Blink yet. It is getting delivered right now. Oh, AWS. God. Press is just running away the entire time. And this time Malik doesn't have a way out. BP2 with the kill. You see the entire group of PC press running in one direction. You see Tom chasing after them. It's the entire time. Just up. Up. Omar in the tree, he's gonna get spotted out, the Gauss will be killed off. And he's gonna make sure B2 gets himself that Burma and G steal. Yoink, 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 towards mid. Yokam and WS. It's gonna get them on to Yokam. Will be controlled. He is gonna get taken up by WS is looking for new. He will force staff himself to the low ground. And it is on the run. Can they get the catch? Razor is fast. But so is a coddle with its spirit form used to the DP out for no range for the frostbite. So, silence on to Malik. Roll up G1 doesn't have a roll of just yet, gonna get lasted up and then last one. We'll find a big kill. That's a big, big, big kill. Even against the razor as an extra four. Yes. Especially because Pope's engaged mid. Oh, one is going to get caught in mid. And they will find the kill on to Noob. Omar is on the run as well. And should drop dead to WS, who's now on the dominating streak. Let me bring back Necrobook. Oh, Alice. WS in trouble. Gets lasso, but he pops the PKB in front, so he doesn't take oh. any damage in the meantime. Told him that the dude won't be a rolling from it. Bumped out. They need to now disengage. B2 looks at the back line. Omar's gonna get controlled up. B2 will be able to get back to the Aji. Malik is gonna be in the next target. They find the two kills. Yeah. Once PKB gets popped, there is zero damage. He raises going wise. Alright. Uh, they need more control for that anti The smoke is gonna run up the high ground. PKB. Oh no! There is no damage! What you gonna do? What's you gonna do when the BKB comes for you? Okay, now BKB wants to be a little bit careful. Actually, the miss spear again by Malik. Oh my god. My dude, he is playing the biggest struggle bus game I've seen in a while. The WS is about to drop down. They already lost. Oh my god. The Bijan Bash comes out onto the 2000 for the double point. The Dallas will be taking out the 2000, getting disengaged. He is rooted up, and that is the smart side of the Scepter coming into play. Oh my god, the next target. WS is still not dead. I thought he died ages ago, but this Razor does not die. They are going to wait the rush to chain sides so they have the cheese. Damn, lift up, drag back, freeze on to tier 2000, has a man style available. V2 has another pound, actually gets the silence off. Punyo is dead. Tier 2000 on the run, WS gonna kill him. Oh no, he gets Ooh. zapped down by Yoka. Blink forward with the stolen blink, actually. And goes back in, will be some. Actually, Lincoln Sphere will save him there from. Oh. Tough situation. Malik's gonna get caught on the other side. It's a four-man move to take down the Mars. But it does mean that they're all very far away from the dire base. TP's coming out V2 and gets the pounds onto TA2000, pops the BKB instantly. That's the nine-second charge used on Anti-Mage. Blink gets stolen again by Yoka, who is on the chase. But there is a cooldown reduction coming in from Noob. Double four staff, but triple four staff even. And now Noob doesn't actually have a way out. He's in trouble on the auto. Can he disengage? Pounce is still on cooldown there for him to get the bash onto the Gallus instead. And the Gallus is paid up. Oh. 
Omar's gonna be the next it's target. WS rushing up on the It doesn't guy. matter. T8 2000 is cutting the waves. At this stage, just so that you have some pushing power. Oh, good. Another one down, and the bottom lane creeps are pushing in. Those creeps have not been cut, and that means they can take it. Gotta save those creeps. T8 2000 is cutting the next wave, man. Smoke drop, looking for an opening. Get a good target. Oh, the blink dodging each other completely. Yokem getting out of them out against the arena. Plus, we on the B2, but the four shots are required to get the Mars out of there. G1 is still chasing and will find him finished off. The back line is the new time doing stuff, but maybe it's still ages on B2. Get back up by T2000. Malik has fought back. He's joining the fight. Yokem has been taken down. And B2 back alive, chunking away at Malik, trying to regain all those stats. Back to the new team. He's lost Completely behind enemy lines though, in front of the <laughs> Dyer's Fountain. He pushes them all the way back. Lincoln's being even soaked up the mana board. And the Charlie what? Like to instantly die? What? Called. But they were, yeah, that was a very interesting one by Charles. Flies <laughs> back, blink out, die. And then calls you. <laughs> Game number three. Which means we go all the way in this series. Uh, hopefully we get an even Stevens game. Maybe some uh, surprise picks to be made. Smoke's going to break it. Okay, smoke free smoke. Malik's going to get spotted. Goes into it with the heavy shield crash. Soaks up so much damage. Ponyo is going to be first blooded. They're looking for a second one. G1 is the second one down. Noob's looking for three kills. And... Oh! 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 That sounds like I was correct. <laughs> then you'd normally see. Limbs comes out onto Omar. It's controlled up, lift up, taken down. Should die soon enough. And he too will be able to secure the kill. That dude says got free farm timing on his face. Malik rolling down the in. No cap. Drops in low. Center stampede. Can they get the Rubik out of there? He's frozen in place. He needs to sidestep. There's his thanks towards Ducalis. Malik does get the kill onto Yokem. She won actually looking for Malik as a possible secondary. Malik's gonna get glimpsed back. Swashbuckle's gonna miss actually. There's no point in kinetic field by Ponyo. But Malik has another flash buckle, shield crash available, and he will actually find Ponyo. Man's playing like an absolute monster. But it's better than, than Mage's Lair. Okay, there's smoke. Okay, WS, bottom. Being chased by the rolling thunder. WS dropping low. Has a big heal, gets a two man stomp. Crystal made an ulti. That's a huge Ducalis all from the side. Will be able to get anything in response to that storm on top of them. Malik gets glimpsed right back inside the stack. Some stolen crystal. The Shaven ulti being used in the process, but still they're getting absolutely smacked on Talon. V2 can't even join his teammates. Malik gets a triple kill. It's a rain, something that they really are terrible against. US in mid, he does have eternal shards, so he's severely tanky, but the last one's gonna catch the Rubik. Tries to get a nice steal, does get it onto the Crystal Maiden. WS wants to kill off Ducalis. Can Ducalis get taken down? One more hit indeed. WS is actually very tanky. Well, with the decent children in the finder, there will not be much more to be gained. It is getting out of control here, Ryer. Look how much they fear the magic damage. WS has a eternal drought and he's playing for a fight. And he's still dying. Oh. They know he is in the area, they just saw the lightning bolt come out. Rolling thunder from behind. There's a snap beat, they're trying to run away. Saxon connect field onto Omar. They blow up the bat right if you can pop the BKB on the run. WS. Gonna get away is gonna be left behind Crystal Maid and Ulti on top will find the center. They also managed to get rid of Chi Wan on the Ember Spirit, so a double kill with a godlike streak for Malik. Uh, their side of the map will force him to do the base. So Run away, WS. There is a lasso available and it's interrupted. So lasso used, WS Centaur is dead. Okay, they're just oh, they're looking to around. take a fight right now. 
Smoke v smoke. Smoke gets broken, TA 2000 walking up the high ground. There's gonna be a quick blink onto the green side. Static comes back here with the Misty. Got Eclipse coming in, but TA 2000 is running out of there. Half mana still left. The damage is too much. Jesus. And that looks like a GG fight. That was. I... Too much evasion. And Amber's not that. That hero who deals a uh, tons of damage. The smoke just broke and Centaur just jumps into so without hesitating, you know. They need to try to find the back line. They are wrapping around again. Oh Ponyo. Quickly gets lassoed up. No sack storm coming into that fight. Will buy back and meet the on the run. Has a blink dagger, but he cannot get himself out of there. Try to lift up with the telekinesis, but that's a death without a buyback. Destroyed. By TA 2000. Oh, Malik jumps up the high ground. The back is up on the G1. We'll be able to jump slightly back, but they cannot be engaged. Sagstorm has the new point here. We'll just be right clicked by Zeus. God gaming. And WS. Oh, plus, I did. He has a BKB eternal shroud, so he won't just die, but they have nothing left, really. I guess Luna has a BKB Eclipse. But there's a bunch of creeps that can first have to do this before I can see them become useful. Go. Fountain Dive Goosa. Go. There's gonna be a jump on the back line trying to go for Malik and they get the kill. Kill one of the cores at least this game. She wants gonna get frozen on the side. They're chasing for B2. He's still on the run. Malik can get the slash buckle stun. Won't attempt it. But it will be WS dead on the side. He tune and she won in their fountain. And it looks like they're gonna have to play another day on the side of top. And it is the DG called and PSC Quest. Take game number three and they back to secure themselves. Aimbot still didn't have a leaving game.